Welcome back to our prehistoric planet park build. We got fossils. Let's get these cleaned up and processed. 97% Anki. So that probably means we have another 3%er left. Could be two 2%ers two maybe. Or like two, three tile fossils, I mean. Let's hold on to those then. Um, yeah, send you back out. All right. Uh, this is what I've started for fence stuff. So, started sedating the Trodons to move them over to here. This is going to be our herbivore enclosure, and then this is going to be the big expanded Quanju enclosure, where we might release even more um, if, if, we, if we want to. This just feels like a very tiny enclosure for so many little Tyrannosaurs. Big, so many medium-sized Tyrannosaurs that uh, I think we ought to throw some more in there. I, I think we ought to give them a bigger area, and then we can throw some more in there. All right, Mosa 2. Uh, are you going to play nice? I have no clue. Dramatic exit, though. Shark needs three. Read up on this new objective, um, and then let me know you're going to do it. Missing shark. Missing shark. Area is at 81%. The territory is nearly full. Which, in my mind, says that there's no way we can meet the requirement. Okay, well... Time to pick which one stays. Are you about to do the thing? He's about to do the thing. Large appetite, humble. Uh, large appetite, long lived, and humble on two. So two is a straight upgrade on one. We can measure our success by our head count, especially the ones that are still attached to them. Do you guys like that, huh? All, all fucking thirty of you watching the Mosa. Um, all right, capture team, trank one. <laughs> so let's strive for that. Might want to get that shark in there just to make sure we don't have uh, an issue with them fighting. You know what? It'll be fine. I've always strived to be the best. That's my motto. Uh, anyway. Where does that leave us? We're in on Anki. We're doing the expedition. We did Dreadnoughtus research. We're, we're kind of done with a lot of stuff there. All right, Trodons down here. Yeah, let's just, uh, let's just get them in here for now. Then we're gonna build the Trodon exhibit first, like the proper final Trodon exhibit. It's a little small. But I think we can make it work. I have a concept in mind. Pretty easy to think of a concept for the Trodon. The uh, the Trodonted sequence is pretty distinctive. Uh, very obvious what he does in that scene. The little Trodonted, the little pyromaniac that he is. I think that's all them moving. That's just smart planning. Are you sedated? Out of the problem by figuring out your excuse. No, you're still queued up. Oh, because they have to go through the hatchery. Sure. You did it. Get, come on, dude. I want to get this dude out of here before we have problems. I mean, the other one's just chilling so far. I guess I'm on slow mode, huh? Let's speed this up. Is there actually like a drone? What do they do? Is there like a little submersible or something? Oh yeah, it's like in a, it's inside of them. Of course it is. Oh, then he floats to the top and bobs there, huh? Oh, that's funny. All right, uh, sell this mosasaur to a dog food factory, and then you'll be happy. Nom 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 nom. Nice shark. Yeah, at some point that'll update. 
Uh, okay, so. Oh, I wonder if Locarno knocked it through the woods. And that's how that happened. We'll just let it get destroyed, I guess. Who cares? Um, so, this is the new segment of the park that we're building. So we kind of got to figure out what it is we're going to do with it exactly. In terms of like a layout and everything. For now, we'll just connect these guys up and maybe get a... Uh, it's going to be a little weird because that kind of connects up. Yeah, let's just do this. This is easier. Boop, and then a boop. Uh, actually, there's, there's, yeah, we're going to put a tour in as well, I think. Um, so why don't we do this? We'll just come from you, like that. This comes over this way. You link up here. Maybe just uh, have you connect down like that. And then like that, and then yeah. So just have like a nice like a rectangular plaza here, kind of. It's kind of situation with a little offshoot down there, like that. I think that's fine. Uh, Trodons, you need a feeder. One prey feeder. We'll put it over here by the viewing gallery and the entry place. But they need more forest. I'm happy to oblige. So what I want to do is we want to start by filling this thing basically up with forests for the most part. I'm willing to leave the front part a little bit there, I think. Right like this. Uh, the water doesn't count as being in there anymore. And I want to do a little thing like this. So I guess we'll just do a little bit, get that water revealed. Okay. So they got a nice forest with a little bit of a clearing here. What we want to do is we want to try and replicate the vibe of it being burnt out. So I'm going to go ahead and grab the dirt. We'll come through here with the dirt. Kind of like this. Maybe leave the grass strip up here in the front so that it kind of looks like, you know, the forest burnt until it reached like the grassland. Or maybe the grassland's coming back in to like reclaim the area, something like that. We'll get the ranger station and stuff connected back up a little bit. Just a little bit of, uh, you know what? Actually, the grass looks a little weird. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just do all of it as dirt. Because it gets so close to the fence that it looks really unnatural because the fence is always dirt. So yeah, we'll just do that. Okay, and then if we look at the brushes, there is, I forget which thing has logs. It is not this brush. This brush is ground fiber. Ground fiber is not the one with logs. Um, what am I doing? Ground leaf is the struthy one, which has logs. OK, so I have an idea. Um, we're going to try an experiment here. So if we go ground leaf. Let's get this brush a little bit big and we'll just uh, run this through here like this over top of the dirt and then shrink it down and then grab the brush to remove and then basically um, so there's a stump there stump there there's a log proper right there so I want to make sure we keep that guy in there so we're trying to kind of remove the plants around the stumps and stuff that we want to keep. Actually, that's working good. So we kind of have these like burnt out forest areas then with these like stumps and trees, uh, stumps and logs, I mean, that are uh, still there from the, when the fire raged the Trodon started. 
little pyros. Now, I'm curious too, if we grab this ground leaf again and we put it back in, is it ever going to spawn logs? I, I have a feeling that like the brush is effectively like revealing and hiding a predetermined layer so that you can't like keep putting it down to try and get logs. Like I have a feeling the logs are always in this area. I don't know if that's true or not. Let's do an experiment in a second. I just want to try and see it. Yeah, that's not bad. You get get this clearing with dirt, and you get a few logs and some plants growing up around the logs. That's not too shabby. Uh, what do we have for decorations that could help with this? I don't think we really have much of anything. Oh, there's a whole f other rock layer down here I was kind of missing. The rock actually kind of vaguely resembles a stump. Yeah, that's not bad either. Um, decorations, decoration tab. Or is this, this tree, no, this tree is the one that looks more burnt out. Yeah, I think that's the one that looks more burnt out. We'll throw, you throw a few of these in, in here kind of just randomly mixed in, just like some survivor trees that are all burnt. It's not bad. And then all these other guys are in like potted plant or uh, planters that don't look really, don't really look good. And every yeah, everything else is too. There's too much other. Is that just a traffic barrier? Sure is. Okay, well, I don't think that's bad. I think this should work. I think this is a I think that's a solid little little version of the fire blasted forest for the Troodon here. That's not bad. Given our limitations, that's not bad at all, I think. I'm pretty happy with it. Okay, uh next. So these guys are out. I want to make sure we get these fences upgraded. We're going tier four fences. So let's get the perimeter upgraded here. We just have uh, just one tree hanging out there by itself. That's cute. Uh, we can take this section out now. This goes. We don't need you. Uh, I'm curious, actually. Let's let's look at our brush theory that I just talked about. If we go to ground leaf, this was the one, right? Okay, we get a log right there, right between these terrain contours. Ground leaf log right between those terrain contours but that log that log might not have been there before log here log there no both logs show up right by each other in the same spot yeah i imagine it's like it's not randomly generated when you use the brush it's like either randomly generated for the map or there's just like a single like file that exists in the game that shows just an array of different vegetation and the files overlaid on top of every game map. And when you use the brush, it reveals part of that like layout maybe, or it's like a tessellating pattern that repeats in a grid. It could be that too. Um, but it seems like the point is that at any given point on the map, you're gonna have the same stuff. We probably disrupted the Troodon Alpha. Although I don't know if we had a particular alpha, so it might not matter. I like that our Jeep is in here still getting like fucked up. It's funny. Is there any way to like... There should be a way to like reset the Jeep if it gets stuck like this. It's really dumb that you can't. I don't want to delete the forest to let it out. Because that's going to mess up the nice circular little Carnotaur area that we've got carved in there. 
You can't like um, reset it from here in any way, can you? Oh, the males are challenging each other for dominance. Can we get to the fence, maybe? Maybe if we're over here, we can get the Carnos to kick us to the fence at some point? I don't know. We really should just figure out a good way to get the Jeep out of there. Um, oh, is our Mosa good yet? Yes. Okay, one solitary Mosa. If we added one more node to this, it probably would have been fine for both. But I don't want to, so we're not going to. Uh, we built enough stuff around it that I don't want to have to expend it at this point. What am I doing? Monorail is what I'm doing. Monorail. Monorail. We'll do monorail over here. I want to come through in here. Swing over this way. I don't really want to run through the Carno exhibit, so we're trying to not do that. Obstructed by Paleo Medical Facility, no matter what, because you're rude. You're very rude to me. Obstructed by Viewing Platform, because you're very rude to me. Oh my gosh. There's got to be a sweet spot here. Yes. Yes, there is. And I get two legs down so that it looks like the monorail is actually reasonably stable. Um, sure. Great. So you come over there. Uh, let's swing you out here along this roadway. And then you actually should arc over closer to the Quan Zhu pen here so that you have visibility while you're there. And then probably swing out and around the hotel. Ah, uh, that looks pretty gross. Not a fan. Not a fan. Let's go this way. Sure, that seems fine. There's our little monorail. We zooming all the way around and up and around there. Power, 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 power. One large substation, centrally located, would catch all of that. Can't squeeze it in over there. Can squeeze it in over here, but then we need two. We actually might need two anyway. Because if, I don't know how far back we're going to start the desert exhibit. Let's just put it like in the middle. I guess we run it back and along there. We can sneak it in. Actually, maybe this is fine. Yeah, I'm happy with that, I think. I think that's fine. So that powers all that. Uh, anybody need toilets? You guys aren't using that section yet, so you still think it's just fine. Um, we can go ahead and toss a shelter down tight to this guy, because that's always a good spot to stick your shelter. And then we can go ahead and toss down one of the old toilets, which can't be squeezed in anywhere there. It's not much of a concern. Where do we want to put our amenities for the sector? Probably back here. Okay. Um, we could squeeze toilets all over the place. Let's just squeeze it over here then. That seems fine. Okay. So that takes care of all of that. We still will have Anki coming in. Um... Do I want to get cheeky? Do a little bit of this.
Okay, so they will fight. Uh, long live Nocturnal. Trodots could poison each other? I didn't even know they could do that. Long live Nocturnal. What's the deal? Now you're both poison idiots. I don't think poison's permanent. They're not even the alpha. Neither of them is the alpha. Is their need still not good? Health, 100%. Yeah, because I can't... Because my Jeep is stuck in the woods. I can't actually status check. Trodons. Get in there. Go. Check them. Where the fuck are you? Oh my god. Give me a different Jeep. Over here. Ranger Rick, go. Get in there and check some dudes. I need to know what's happening in here, especially now that they're poisoned. Blah. Worst comes to worst, we just end up having to rebuild them or something. Um, expand, my friends. Expand. We'll have to uh, rebuild the rest of the fence, upgrade it. We'll probably do it during the storm sometime. Uh, are you connected up? You should be connected up. I think you're fine. Everything's powered. How are we doing four power? Running a little low, but not critically so. Okay. Uh, where are my damn Jeeps? There he is. He's getting over there. I think at this point... Well, no. Let's let the Quanjus move around a little bit. Uh, and we should set their exhibit up to be, well, properly forested, maybe, huh? So let's think about this. If we're designing an exhibit for real, right, what do we want it to be like? Well, we would want it so that the visibility areas don't completely block your, your view. Except for the towers, maybe. Towers are fine, because they see over the treetops. Also, the gates we would strategically not want to block. But... Yeah, for the forest vibe, we do want a good chunk of forest in here. Actually kind of like the idea of there being like a clearing back here. Um, something like that. And then they like rock. Since I don't have a strong idea of what to do for their enclosure, we'll just go ahead and paint in some rock in these gaps for them. Might as well keep them happy that way. And it helps them to, uh, they can move around too. That way they're not clustering where there is just, like in the one area where there is rock. Even though the rock brush is like kind of weird, to be honest. It's just kind of like, why is there all this rock here? But whatever. And then we'll go ahead and uh, maybe throw some rocks at him too. How about one rock of every type in here somewhere? Uh-oh, I think I started switching rows. I don't know where I am. I don't know which rocks I've done and which ones I haven't. That's fine. We'll just throw rocks at them. Yeah, we haven't done any in this top row. All 
All right, there's the Quanju Forest. Status check, please, somebody. None of them have status checks because my idiot employee is stuck in a goddamn... <sighs> paddock with a bunch of peaceful Carnotaurs that won't even destroy his ass. Unbelievable. Wait, is he? Wait. Yeah, he's still stuck in the woods. Okay. And I still can't drive him out of there. I don't have anything like I can hit him against either to kill him. <laughs> Get him back that way. Um, we're just kind of stuck. Okay, Anki's in though. Hopefully the Anki's done then. Yeah, great. So we'll get these guys going. Um, sure. You can get rested. We got the other welfare specialist, so it should be fine. Expedition map. Dreadnoughtus next. Bam. 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 Okay. Maybe we should just uh, medical scan these Trodons. They also might be like rabid or some shit. That's entirely possible. Why are you? No path. Oh, you're you're literally are not connected. I thought I did it. I literally looked at it twice too. Um, that's sad. It's very sad. 74% health, 66% health. Okay, finally, every, these jokers are getting there. Good God. I need somebody to go check on the Quanjus too. Make sure they're good. Anybody? Please. Please, idiots. Do it. I th think the poisoning will go away eventually in this game. I don't think it's permanent like it was in the first game. That's a big, I think, unfortunately. Yeah, they're happy. It wasn't, it was probably, I don't know, like a stress fight from changing exhibits? Almost? If that's a thing. 100% on that. Um, okay, so I guess I want to get the Ankies out before we put down the exhibit here, but I have a plan for the, the Anki exhibit. So let's build that. Now. This is the Anki and the Trix. The Anki doesn't do shit. It just walks by in the forest scene, right? Um, but the Trikes have a very extended scene of them going into a cave. We can't make a cave. But what we could do is try and make a canyon, which is like a cave without a roof. You know? Kinda. It kind of is. So that's my idea here. Let's drop the elevation in here a bit. And that's maybe a little too much. Because I do want it to not be super... Well, I want the sides to be super steep, but I don't want it to be super narrow, necessarily. Yeah, okay, so we can do this. We can flatten to that. Uh, that might be pretty good already. So basically, I want to peel the forest back from this canyon track. Kind of like that. Now. Now, now, now. I want... Actually, let's do it. Oops. Let's move this canyon a little bit. I'm going to put a tour in, and the tour is going to interact with the canyon, is the idea. So we'll move this over this way a little bit. So that curves. Okay. And I want to kind of smooth out a ramp, basically, to exit the canyon and enter it. So we'll do that, we'll do this. Like 
like that. Okay. Tour. We put in trucks before. Why don't we just do a gyrosphere just for diversity's sake? Just for fun. So I'm thinking the gyrosphere kind of just goes along here. A bit like this. Swings around and then heads down into the bottom of the canyon and travels along there for a little, little Triceratops adventure in the dark. Before swinging back up top and returning. Something uh, just like that, I guess. Now. Now uh, we need a little bit of water. Let's do some small puddles of water. Stick one right here, kind of near the front. Stick one maybe back over here, near the back. And how about over here in between this track? And then I want a lot of the rest of this to be pretty forested because we, well, it's still a forest exhibit. But we are going to want to try and get in our, um, we need to get our, our plants in here too for the Yankees and Trikes though. So we're going to be aware of that. So maybe this is most of the forest is actually this back section here. Yeah, let's not bother with too much of that. We'll wait until we've actually got the other stuff in. Uh, and then rock. And then we have our quote unquote cave. Our cave without a ceiling. It's perfect. It's a cave with a view. That's what it is. You know, we got the top down. It's summer, right? We want to let the uh, the wind flow through our hair, or in the case of the Triceratops, through our horns, I guess. <laughs> tree is a little bit yeah okay there's our uh, triceratops game you know what that actually looks kind of good like that that actually looks like a proper little cave depression thing wow i'm actually impressed by how good that looks we could throw a few little rocks in here i guess uh maybe these ones that match it a little bit more what is the control space random orientation? One of you, one of you, get one of you on top of that weird grass that shouldn't be in there, I don't think. Oh, this one's like a proper stalagmite thing going on here. A little canyon okay cool are you guys gonna die you idiots i feel like i had the trodons poison something or each other before i don't think it was i didn't think it was each other i think it was like an escape or something maybe in one of the videos and then i was able to just heal them through it whenever i got poisoned but maybe i'm mistaken and i don't know what i'm talking about So, and then we need to work on the desert exhibit. We'll do that next episode. And then at some point, we need the Rex. Oh. On that note. So, yes, Quan Ju. We did status check somebody in here. Can anybody tell me who that was? Oh, my God, guys. Why are you... Wait, nobody got status checked. Are you friggin' kidding me? Oh, he's still on the way. He hasn't even gotten there yet. Fair enough. Fine. Somebody kill Ranger Team 1, please. Destroy them, Carno. I'm, ba I'm literally begging you to kill my employees. That's all I want you to do. Please. Who are you status checking, my dude? Stat somebody. Um, anybody. Tell me what these guys need. Are they happy? Are they sad? Vehicle under threat. That's the wrong Jeep. 
Don't destroy that Jeep. Okay, you guys are super happy. Good. Okay, great. Um, so, what are we going to do? We're going to isolate a section temporarily. Actually, let's grab over here with the water. Okay. Then we want to grab uh, the strong one of the strong ones that's not the alpha. Yeah, this one. We'll sedate you and transfer you. There's even a goat feeder in there, maybe? Goat? No, there's no goat feeder in there. I think we destroyed it. Uh, let's make sure... Well, no, because he'll have prey, in theory. The other one's probably about to tick over to low health, too. Maybe if we medical treat him here, this will help. Maybe. Okay, Ankies are done. Let's get them going. Synthesize, Anki. Needy and antisocial. With defensive, though, that's something we need. Okay, Anki, it is green. I went through and I found what I thought was the best green from Anki. And I thought it was... Um, uh... uh uh, <laughs> uh, it was somewhere in my notes. That's where it was. Ah, yes. Okay, it was uh, Champlain, I thought, was the best green with blank. Because if you give them a pattern, they actually get less green overall. I don't think I care about antisocial. Let's just do humble. Tolerant won't matter. It's just two enclosures. Or it's just uh, two dinos in the enclosure. I don't know. Let's just 25% chance, long live 25% chance resilient. Roll the dice for some sick, sick Ankies. Let's see what happens. 14 genetics, yeesh. Actually, no, do you, yeah. Since there's only one Anki in, well, not even, an, there's not even any Ankies. Since there's only one Anno whatever in Prehistoric Planet, we're not gonna breed many. We're gonna deliberately keep them understocked just for theming. Yeah, 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 whatever. I don't care, my dude. Oh, we shouldn't build amenities. I can't believe this Jeep is still here. Okay. I, I, we gotta, it has to leave. We can't, um, this is disrupting the park. That actually wasn't that bad. <laughs> that actually worked out just fine. Okay. Watch it get destroyed on its way out. Storm, shit. Okay. Okay. Um, oh, the Trodons are done. They're healed. They're not sick. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. Um, okay. What do we want to feed this guy? Just raptors? Let's try raptors. We get so we'll just assign them to synth raptor. Okay, first damage structure is what, where? It is a visitor's building down there. Oh my god, did you see that? The Jeep just literally ran into the side of a friggin' Carno. How are you poisoned again? Why are the Trodons fighting? Okay, 
Here's my main takeaway. If you want your dinos to never fight, never, ever move them away from their current area, that might have been a dominance fight. Because the alpha's involved here. Seven and two. Uh, these guys are equivalent. I don't know why you're fighting. Okay. Um, well, nobody's dying. It's fine, I guess. Uh, what else is damage? I went from one to three real quick there on damage things. I got distracted by my little, my little idiot children fighting. Uh, you, damaged friend, go do this. Waiting for drone. How about you do some repair work, my dude? You can repair that. Since you're coming up this way, why don't you just go grab all these other buildings? They're relatively low importance. Okay. The Quanju is awake. He is lonely. He is missing prey. He is missing water. Let's make sure he's got the water he needs, at least. I wonder if giving him a raptor will count as prey. We'll take one of these intolerant ones. We don't want the fit one because it'll be harder for him to kill in theory. I mean, I'm hoping he just mercs these guys and it counts as a victory fight and it's just good, um, but we don't know. Two eggs, skittish, antisocial. I mean, whatever, it's fine. And our Dreadnoughtus is about to come in. Boom. That is a whole lot of Chordate fossils. Why in the world do you have so many Chordate fossils? What was that about? Okay, um, sure. Two Dreadnoughtus for you. Sending out you and... And uh, you, I think. And then you get rested. Thank you, everybody. Okay. So the raptors are coming in a minute. Um, Quanju, are you going to hit the fence? 70%. So you look like you're good. A second a storm shows up, you're in trouble. He should be good in general if we get him some food, though. Um, let's do these shops over here. So, food drink and shopping yeah so we'll do food um we want a lot of green i feel like we've already done falafel vegan moussaka whatever that is ice cream parlor aquarium don't care seems good drinky drink Superfood juice. Sure. I don't think we have that. Um, photo booth with aquarium. Oh, we need a little bit more white. 83. Sure. Actually, we should probably just do... Well, that's not going to work either. All right, sure, screw it, uh, it's fine. Wait, was Entertainer better? I think it might have been. Yeah, it is, 83. Thought that said obstructed by lame amenity. I'm like, yeah, it is pretty lame, you're right. You're right. Um, adoptions, we might have adoptions, I don't remember. Eh, 
entertainer, whatever. Oh, um, okay, so we got some other shops here that are underperforming. 37. 35. How about charity for my multi-million dollar dinosaur park? Please, sir, just a little money. Oh, this one was super weird. Why did we set this one up like this? There's like no future proofing in this whatsoever. Although to be fair, that might not matter that much. Well, that one's actually at high capacity too, 713. I mean, the Mosasaur is a huge draw. So that's going to be over capacity when we put the Rex in, which I guess is probably not the biggest problem in the world, but... Um, Eighty nine. Green is a little low. Sure, what not? That seems fine. Great. Well, that seems fine. Uh, comfort 52%. That is... Okay. We're going to just count on them fighting properly. Because otherwise you're going to... Okay, yeah. 71%. Otherwise, he's going to like hit fences and stuff, and we can't deal with that. Release fight airlift one Velociraptor. Here you go. Here's your playmate. You guys have fun. You kids play nice now. Um, and yeah, you're dying because you idiots have poisoned each other. Unreachable. Yeah, well, I'm sure you'll figure something out, my dude. Minute on the Anki. A few minutes on Dread. Let's look at our ratings, amenities, 80%. We do have that whole section of the park, though, that doesn't have shops yet. We'll put them in after we get that. Accommodation, shelter, restroom are all low. Okay. That's um, fair enough. One shelter. Really? You guys need a new shelter? Fine. I'm fine. That's fine. I'll give it to you. One toilet. For this section, you cannot fit a toilet in there. Okay. Um, we'll toss it over here because that's kind of back by the mountain edge. So that's probably fine. Also, if we send Jeeps through, um, we might want to make sure we've got a nice clear path here for them. Especially because the inside of the paddock is very tree heavy. So if we need to repair fences heading along the outside here manually is probably a good way to go. Same with this spot. Get rid of those trees in the gap. Okay, dokie. Oh, uh, I'm really curious if the healing it actually dealt with the poison. Or if the poison just wore off coincidentally. I think the medical team actually removes the poison if you queue that up. If, like it has to be low enough that I think they actually dart it for health though because the first time it didn't work but that's two right away where the poison disappeared the second we clicked on them um, so it's pretty good oh, yeah, all the truthies are down here by their little uh, egg laying area that's nice I'm glad they're enjoying it I have a soft spot for this dinosaur the velociraptor and they get a bad rap as far as I'm concerned kill it but if you imprint early kill it you can make real connections with them. Kill it. Other than Claire, Raptor might have a problem here. Partners I've ever had. And like her, they can kill me in the blink of an eye. <laughs> that's a that's a joke. We don't want to engineer aggression out of the dinosaurs, but kill it though. To make sure we are monitoring it and to the extent we can. This might not work. Small predator, large predator. You, uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, we have a problem. Hmm. 
Why are you all in this corner? Facilitate a fight to the death. You know what? That'd be great, except that you're not going to be the fight I want you to be. Here's what we'll do. We'll move the Quan Ju in there. It's, it's comfort doesn't matter anymore. So let's just put a second layer of fence in here to uh, make sure that it can't escape. And we'll keep it, keep trying to have it fight. Our plate may be full, but there's we'll see, we'll keep trying to get this to work. Read up on this next objective. Unlike the dinosaurs, I want you to stay hungry. Rampaging. Ooh, I've never seen it actually say rampaging. He's gonna climb that fence. This is this is a goofy game we're playing here. Okay, Ankies, please report to park. Oh, uh, we need toughness for trike. We need to keep breeding Ankies, actually. I said we weren't gonna breed a bunch. I'm a liar, boy. We have none with defensive. Yeah, so we're gonna keep breeding Ankies. Um, I think we'll keep just two, but we absolutely need to do the breeding. So 13 and a friend, not the, not that one. Um, then that one gets released and we breed a second set. We'll need it for sure. Dreadnoughtus on one of you. Dig up more Dreadnoughtus on you. Okay. I need you guys to fight. Fight. Quanju, fight him. Quanju, fight him. Not sure if it'll work. God, this sucks. I hate, I hate the fight prerequisites for research. They suck. They suck a lot. Welcome, Inky. Uh, missing ground fruit. Missing ground leaf. Leaf and fruit and water, but you'll have that in a second. All right, let's shrink this brush down a bit. There's your leaf. You put the fruit back here. You'll be fine. You just need to move around a little bit. They call this the You'll Ankylosaurus. Find. I call it an armored ball of walking, breathing trouble. St nope. Some might call it charming, amusing, delightful. Right. You're missing ground leaf. Uh, ground leaf. Where that tree? Whatever. It's fine. Uh. Okay, that's a medical undiagnosed ailment on you. Sure. Quanju, fight him. Quanju, fight him, please. I'm begging you, fight. Fight him. Oh my god, dude. You're unbearable, guys. Um, more Anki. A sign. 13 and a 3. Bible 2, Skittish Antisocial Humble, Antisocial Humble Resilient. Uh, discard. Synthesize. Anki, a sign. This sucks. Uh, this sucks a bit. Begin. I don't have anybody left that can do fossils. Um, that is no longer true. One, two, assign you. Begin. Uh, 
Uh, we need a new hotel. Do, do, do. Okay, we're missing a restroom still. Okay, yeah, down here that makes sense actually because we have a, a bit of an extended path there, of course. We'll see if that's close enough. It should be. Um, and then we need that hotel, large hotel. We'll put it in over here. Obstructed by main thoroughfare. Figured it would be the pylons, actually, if anything. I like this. We've already got a weird corner path thing going on here. Seems like a good spot for a hotel right around that weird corner. Fight! If you want to eat, you have to eat that raptor. Success has a feeling all of its own, and you should be feeling it right about now. Oh, he looked at him. Fight him. Fight him. Dude. Okay, this experiment doesn't seem like it's going to work. Um... Yeah, you should go that way. Great. Oh, fuck, there's a goat in there still. Well, that sucks. We can uh, we can start trapping them closer and closer together. See if that works to encourage them to fight. Uh, this raptor's freaking dying. Okay, um, what if we bred more raptors? So let's breed, let's try this, let's breed another batch of raptors, throw them in there. Hey Mr. Ankies, um, you're still missing some environmental needs, huh, of both types. There we go. Two happy Yankees. It's not gonna quite work. I'm thinking two in general, kinda. It's kind of my thought. Are they seriously not gonna fight? Just kill the raptor. So you're not gonna do it because he's happy, or not happy? Okay, well, there's another thing we could do here, which is two Quanjus is still not that bad. Okay, so why do you guys have no frigging comfort data? It doesn't matter. We know they're happy. We just need to find which one we're going to put in. Yeah, this one's only humble. Let's grab that one. And we'll transfer him in there. Uh, then that'll be enough population, and then they should be okay. Raptor eggs, I'm taking all of these. Five, I'm sure you, who cares? Okay, then we got a defensive Anki coming, if we wanna keep it. I guess we could sell off this one. Commencing asset transit. Okay. 
Um, because the other one's humble and the alpha. So yeah, I guess we'll just cycle out Ankies. Because we don't want to just like not hatch the things. Okay, well we're technically, yeah, we're at five stars there on rating, but it's deceptive and a liar. This one is way too good to pass up. Okay, Quanju number other. Now, in theory, I think these guys will actually be happy if we re-expand the territory. I think. Please status check. check it out. I think you'll agree. Uh, we can also use the medical team now to like top these guys up. And we should be able to repair the fences fast enough that we shouldn't have to worry yes, about them um, the breaking before. out. Okay, well that's dumb. I hate that. Bad timing, not a fan. Alright, sell that Anki off. We can convert into that one's extraneous. First damage structure. And the only place they can see and visit them for real is right here. Second damage is the viewing gallery. That's also not a big priority. Third damage building is another viewing gallery. Oh no, that's, wait, that's the same viewing gallery? Uh, okay, it's, oh, um, clearly we're out of power in this park. If the backup generator down there just exhausted itself. Um, let's get another power station in here. Put one there, put one there. I guess we'll keep the power all in the same like sector of the park just for, I don't know, theming reasons. Oops, it's not a path. You're a path. Okay, 51 because of the cohabitation issue, which you guys should just sort out by killing him. But you won't do that. Uh, we're missing shelter down here. Restroom rating is 100%. Accommodation rating 100%. Fire airlift. One, two, three. To repair that, please. You'd be able to handle that objective. I don't care about status right. checking the raptor. Well done. Fix the fence. Transporting asset. Shit. <sighs> what are you doing? Asset transportation okay. Um. Uh, that's fine. No, stop it. Stop it. Helicopter. Mr. Copter. Please don't sedate. Cancel. Cancel that. Did you actually fix that, though? Please back up. Repair complete. Yes. Okay, I wasn't convinced. Eat those raptors, you idiots. Okay. Um, well, the raptors are going. Anki number two can go out. Or three, but it's the second Anki for the population. And then breed more Ankies. We need defensive genome. Assign you with a friend. A s I'm going to wait for that one to be released. Fossils are in. 
Amber, Amber, and Amber. We're done with Dreadnoughtus, which means all we have left are Trike and uh, Rex, which is a fun one-two combo. I guess we'll use the Logistics Specialist here so that they can get rested. You rest. Um... Please eat them. I mean, they're gonna be hungry. Okay, so. The other option is to give them an herbivore to fight. Dislikes carnivores, yeah. So if we give them an herbivore, they won't dislike it actively, which is better. Um... So if they don't fight these raptors soon, actually, let's just start replacing the raptors. They should still fight the packy rhinos if that's like what we put in there. Um, so attack 83, 28, 60, 30. I mean, they should win, especially the strong one should win. I'm not gonna bother editing the genome. We'll just uh, grab somebody and go. Okay, well, we're, we're running up at uh, an hour here for time. One in seven. But you're the alpha. Already. Is one shouldn't want to try to claim that. Fascinating. Ah, ah, shit. Fence, 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 fence. Go, go, fix fence. Go. Um, okay. Well, why don't we end this episode? This has been a long, boring episode of trying to figure out how we can... Oh, son of a bitch. Figuring out how we can get these things to fight properly um, in order to get Rex out. Is the Alpha now at two victories? No, because this is your first fight. All right. We're just gonna we're just gonna get rid of these raptors at this point. This is this is not worth it. We'll just sell these off between episodes. All right, uh, we'll leave this one here then. Till next time.